Oh, ladies and gentlemen, um, bist schon drauf? Englisch? Uh, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to um, Technical Smash University 6. The Ooh, I get some to drink. Uh, thanks. Um, the Prime Beer Regional Tournament Series for Berlin. We're in the uh, Double Loses Quarterfinals. We got the Kraken and Soka, uh, two Berlin based smasher Smashers against. The two uh, out of region players who came uh, today, Frozen Light 1337 and Snacks. Snacks being from uh, Hamburg in northern Germany and uh, Frozen Light being from Würzburg in southern Germany. Oh my god, Frozen Light being the Jigglypuff who uh, did an immaculate job resting there. Oh, and no punish whatsoever. It was just. A oh wow, Frozen Light punishes himself because he thought, like, wow, that should have been punished harder. So yeah, let me jump off there and sing a song. Ooh, Frozen Light gets the edge guard on Soka, and now they're, the Kraken is getting edge guarded. Uh, it's a questionable decision there to not go for the uh, for the AP immediately, to have a fighting chance to get up there instead of doing the AP when it's completely useless when you're already way too low. So yeah, the Kraken definitely he, he recently like picked up Luigi as a character as main character, so um, he's still trying around, you know, trying to figure out how to shoot first. So yeah. 
Uh, by the way, 1-0, if you, if you have, haven't seen it, 1-0 uh, for Snacks and Throws right already, with uh, Snacks making an immaculate uh, 2v1 comeback in the former game, and now it's looking much more like... Oh! Oh! Ho, ho, ho! Looking much more dominant. Frozen Light uh, getting him with the rest, um, almost in the uh, <laughs> like in the top blast zone there, and yeah, just waits for it and ooh, sweet, sweet instant replay by the way. Good job here um, for the stream. Uh, so Pokemon Stadium. I wonder how this is gonna work out. I'm pretty sure they went Pokemon Stadium so Soka can kill um, Jigglypuff easier. Uh, Frozen Light, that is. Soka being the fox. Uh, so he can kill Jigglypuff easier, but uh, on the on the other hand, his t uh, stock tank, the Luigi player, uh, the Kraken, is also going to fall way earlier than he would on other stages. Even though Pokemon Stadium and uh, Final Destination don't differentiate too much, it still makes a significant difference to, um, to consider. That's why... It, like, they picked the stage in the first place, you know. But Luigi dying not as fast as Jigglypuff does. This actually is, um, it's like gives the blue team possibly the upper hand. The blue team has been um, has been showing that they like they have the potential to beat the green team. But the green team just in the first game they clutched it out, and in the second game they just were a little more, more dominant over the course of the game. Ooh, the Shuriken not being quite enough. Uh, Shuriken, of course. Um, Reminiscent of uh, what we're going to see tonight uh, with uh, EVO 2015. Showing the world uh, this wonderful game, not only on uh, Shoryuken's uh, EVO channels tonight, but also representing from Berlin, Geeky Goon Squad, Europe's uh, one of the, the finest streams in Europe for, for sure, for Super Smash Bros. Melee, and we're delivering some original action from Berlin. If you guys like it, you can always like you know follow the channel and you get like all the Berlin-based tournaments basically because uh, the Goon Squad is streaming, uh, streaming all of them. Nice up smash there to get Frozen Light at uh, a juicy 126%. So that was way too much for oh wow that Jigglypuff. All oh, the rest is not oh and there we go with the misfire. So yeah, everything basically went wrong for the uh, for the Jigglypuff rest there. He got uh, the full up smash as uh, he got uh, punished by the full up smash and uh, the crack survived it. Oh, oh, this, this could have been big, but both of them were not fast enough to react in time. So, oh wow, Snacks with a beautiful edge guard there, uh, comboing uh, Soka to the right side of the stage and then edge guarding him beautifully with a with a down aerial. Ooh, the Kraken kind of missing hitting reverse on the uh, not hitting reverse on the back aerial for whatever reason. Like that, that was looking super weird, and that was the Kraken's tournament stock possibly. Well, Soka could make this for stock comeback here, but uh, it's highly unlikely that he will. But yo, they troll around like this, and uh, Maxi keeps on out. Never mind. So uh, yeah, that was basically the the second uh, losers quarters, and now I have to play actually myself in the losers semis against the guys you just saw.